Samson was gentle, good, thoughtful, and unsure, as all men are, of the purpose of his life. He began to walk the long road to understanding and faith, a journey which must be made by every man alone. In the palace of the king of the Philistines, another young man was learning the skills of life through the games he played. Watch your guard. Intelligence, attention, concentration, I watch you, you're like a butterfly, you're here, you're there, you're gone. Focus your attention, your highness. Focus your mind completely. Yes. Yes, I know. Try again, General. As you wish, your highness. Never underestimate your enemy. No, father. Good day, Delilah. General Tarras, <laughs> you may rise. I wonder what her father would think of her now, eh, Come on. Ah, true friend and a fine soldier. Who I'm told never underestimated his enemy. Here. Use this one, Commander. Huh. An Israelite sword. What's an Israelite sword? Bronze. They're very primitive people. We've only ever found a single god to worship. Attack! <laughs> Even a broken sword will kill you. You let down your guard, Your Highness. You remind us every day of the reasons why my father values you so highly, Commander. He's possessed of the soldier's most powerful weapon. His intelligence. My name is Yoram. I was more than ten years younger than Samson. I loved him as a brother. We were both Nazarites, dedicated to God at birth. Did I know even then that within him lay the destiny of our people? Perhaps I knew only that I would be with him until the end. <laughs> 